and welcome to Beardicus Plays. My name is Beardicus, and today I am playing Earthbound Beginnings, and I'm still really, really angry, and I forgot to take the headache thing that I said I was going to take in the last episode, but my I don't have a bad headache, so it's okay. Uh, it doesn't matter what Anna does, because Teddy and Ninten, actually Teddy's probably going to one-shot everything now that he's got a katana. Um, ooh, here's another present. What is it? <gasps> it's Life Up Cream. I mean, you know, that's good, I guess. I was hoping for the baseball bat, but, uh, uh okay, it's okay. I just hit him. Anakin, one, two, three, four. Hit him, and Teddy will hit him. And that should kill this guy. This, oh, that'll kill that guy. And then this guy will, not Teddy? Yes. Okay, and that guy killed himself. That's cool. So, Anna didn't even need to do anything, as per the norm. Anna probably feels pretty useless right now, but she should know that it's, it is true, actually. She is kind of useless. But, uh, that's only because we haven't needed her to heal anybody yet. Wait a second. I'm paying attention. You can't fool me, game. I know how this would work. Ha <laughs> ha, see? I oh, he was guarding. Well played, game. Well played. Of course, not that it really matters because that guy still would have done the thing that he was going to do. And then I guess... Uh, I could heal Anna, actually. Nah, I'll do that off. Out of battle. So, that guy guarded again. Didn't do him much good, though. What? Well. I see how it is. I guess, uh... He tried to guard at the end, too. If you're the only one in the fight, there is no point in guarding. Because the only time you would guard is if you were gonna die and you had like a teammate who was gonna do enough damage to end the fight before you died or something. But if you're the only one on your team during a turn-based battle like that, there is no point in guarding. Because you're still gonna take damage, but you're gonna waste your turn lessening the damage you take. But in that turn, you're still only taking damage, not dealing damage. So it's just a lost turn. That's how I see it, anyway. Um, we can life up beta. Or if you just need to survive for a set number of turns, I guess. But in that case, that's not how it was going to work for the Starman. A Cerebrum? Huh. Weird. I don't know if he'll survive an attack, but... Ah, hot tamales. I'm glad I have the water pendants. Because that would have done a lot of damage otherwise. Do I have PK Fire Beta yet? I don't think so. I think it takes a long time to get that move. Well, let's check. Just out of curiosity. Oh, I do have PK Fire Beta. Cool. Again, I don't... Okay, now I know he's not going to survive. But Okay, Ninten taking a lot of damage. What the heck? What is this thing? Okay, but I guess he's out of it seems like he's out of PP, so I can heal people. I can take a turn to just heal. Right? Oh nope. Okay. I was wrong. I guess... I guess, uh... That's on me. That's on me. It's like a beta, Anna. And then she'll, uh... I think it's time to just, uh... Let's just ruin this guy's day. Defense down beta. That's a weird time to use that move. Because the, this is going to be the last turn. We've we've already decided that. So it's just 
that's the kind of move defense down is the kind of move that you want to use as soon as possible um, actually no offense down use offense down first then defense down or on yourself you would use defense up and then offense up because if you're gonna use both of those you're not gonna attack until the third turn so it's pointless to use offense up first you always use defense up first that's that's a little um, as a pro tip for you use offense up second and defense up first always no exceptions unless you're not gonna use both I guess I am very very lost like I'm just gonna admit it I am so completely and totally lost I have no idea where I've been I have no idea where I'm going I'm just going Ugh. and then they gotta throw three of them at me I don't like fighting three of them but I will see if I care two three four beam that guy Teddy that guy so that guy survived that guy survived that guy punched me that guy shielded somebody and that guy died Okay, now we'll just have to, we'll switch them like that. And that guy is super dead. And that guy is super dead. That guy even, I guess that guy was guarding too. And then we go up here. And then we'll go over here. I'm probably going in circles at this point. Okay, so we're gonna take this guy a little more seriously this time. By which I mean I'm just gonna PK beam gamma him. Thunder, ow! Life up, and no effect. That's what I, I actually wholly expected that to happen. Okay, let's try freezing him then. Cause that just because just because beam doesn't work doesn't mean that a uh, freeze won't. Because freeze was able to kill a dragon, so if it works on a dragon, it'll probably work on a brain in a jar. Yeah, see, easy. You're getting all the all the mad. Uh, mad strats. <sighs> oh, I know where I am. Right? Yeah. This is the door that I almost went in during the last episode. And then, uh... Oh, see, it's like, yeah, he guarded, so he survived for an extra turn, but it did him no good in the long run. Whereas when I guarded in the other fight, all that did, all that was for was because Anna wasn't going to be able to attack anyway. I actually, that's the way I came from earlier, which means that now I'm heading backwards. So, wow. Nicely done, Teddy. Okay, okay, we're, we're, we're getting, uh, I ran into the wall, I ran into the wall and I got stuck and then I had to, uh, okay, we gotta, we gotta find our way through these tunnels, we have to, I'm not ending this episode until I get out of these tunnels, with both the frying pan and the baseball bat. That part might be optional though, because I'm actually going to, if I get out of here and I don't have both, I am going to look up a map to find out where they are. Ugh. One, two, three, four. Oh, no, it was three. One, two, three. Freeze him. Oh, Teddy should have guarded. 
Ow, fire. Fire hurts. Don't play with fire, it's dangerous. Okay. Do the clicky clack strategy where I just mash buttons. I have to, like, eventually I'm gonna find my way through here, right? That's how things work. This looks like the frying pan. I don't know if I've ever been as disappointed as I am right now. Like, I am. <sighs> like, that. That hurt, game. That physically. That caused me physical pain. Four. Uh. I assume he was guarding. I wasn't paying attention, but I think that's what happened. Look at all this wasted experience that's going to Teddy. At least in 10 and Anna are also leveling up. Oh, wait. I'm gonna try going to the left again. I know that I said earlier that's the way I came from, but there was another door that way, I think, that I passed up. And going to the right leads me back to the beginning of the dungeon maze thing. Maybe it's over here. Or maybe this is the way I came from earlier. I don't know. I can't remember. Because this... Everything looks the same! I'm confused and I'm scared. I just want to get to the... I just want to get out of here! Oh, fuck. I mean, shoot. God... Damn it, though. Can I just let him hit me a bunch? Does- will guarding stop- take half damage? It takes half damage. Okay, well, he'll kill me eventually. Or maybe that doctor guy at the beginning will revive her. Okay, well, I'll pick this up when I figure out the best way to save Anna. So, I'll see you in a little bit. I'm son of a... Mmm. Angry. Angry pants. I'm an angry pants. I'm so angry. I'm wearing my angry pants right now. That's how angry I am! Life up. <laughs> I don't wanna walk all the way back. I don't wanna. <laughs> Do you know how long it took to walk out here? Why did Anna have to die? Why can't you just revive her? You're a doctor! Revive her! This isn't fair! I don't want to walk all the way back and forth! This sucks! This is the worst! Why? This is even worse than... It's like, you just... Just making it inconvenient doesn't make the game hard or fun or challenging. It makes it inconvenient! <sighs> So, I've been recording for 20 minutes, I've been recording this episode for 20 minutes, seven of which have been off the record, I suppose, and guess what? I'm actually, I've actually made negative progress. How frustrating is that? Okay, and we're back, and it was, and it's all, and don't worry, you didn't miss anything. 
I've only been recording for an extra 10 minutes trying to revive Anna. It took a long time, and you may think that I revived her here in this room, but no. I actually came back here to see if I could revive her here, but you can't. You can't. This guy only f heals your health and fixes you if you're sick or something, but he won't revive you. I had to walk all the way back to town to revive Anna. Or, well, what I did was I used the onyx hook I went to Magic Ant to revive her. Because that way at least I could do it for free and I wouldn't have to walk all the way to town and back. But, I just... This is so stupid. Why would you put this guy here? If, if, like, what's the point of him? There's no point. Why is there no phone in here? There should be a phone. I should be able to save here, or I should be able to revive somebody here. It's so obnoxious that if anybody dies, rather, if Anna dies, Anna is the only one who's gonna die. Let's be real here. Okay, Lloyd died that one time right after I said that right after the last time I said this kind of thing, Lloyd died immediately after, and the irony was lost on me until I was editing the episode. But, but, right now, I have Ninten and Teddy, and both of them are way too good to ever die. Anna is the only one who's gonna die right now, and Anna is the only one who can revive people, because Ninten doesn't learn super healing until like level 35. He needs to level up three more times before he learns super healing. So if Anna dies, I have to walk all the way back to town to revive her. And that is stupid and inconvenient. Thank you for listening to this rant. I'll rejoin you when I find whatever I'm looking for in the caves. Until then, well, and for you it's gonna be a couple of seconds, but for me, I don't know. It's gonna be four hours at this rate. <sighs> I'm sorry. I, I, I've I officially hit a hit my breaking point with this game. Like I was, I I've been getting really angry with all of the um, with all of the uh, random encounters, but it's this level of inconvenience where a character dies and I have to go like 20 minutes out of my way to revive them because as far as I know there are no items in this game I don't have any items that can revive people I don't know if they're if they sell any at the store granted I could have looked for that and I didn't and that's on me but like I I'm not getting any from like presents or anything like that it's just it's so inconvenient and I just I hit my breaking point and now I've ranted about it so I feel a bit better so I will cut ahead to when I find the either the end of those tunnels or one of the items that I'm looking for. So I'll see you then. Hang in there, me. We're almost done. Okay, and we're back. Finally. We're back for real. So, here's the thing, okay? I got really angry earlier. I'm calm now. I've had some time to relax. I looked up a map, so I know exactly where I'm going. Now, this crossroad may seem familiar, because I have been here already. And here's a little, here's a little bit of trivia for you. I went to the left. Guess which direction I was supposed to go? If you guessed left, you're wrong. See, I came from the right. So there are two options left, and if you guessed left, you're wrong. It's supposed to go up. Cut out that fight. Cut it out. Just cut the fight out. Just... Okay, so you come up here. Look at this present. It's a wonderful present, and guess what it is? Guess. It's the freaking frying pan. You know, one of the items that I said I wanted to get... Why, am, why do I still have this bomb? Where? Oh, wait. Oh, I see. So the game says that Nintendo got it, regardless of who actually got it. I forgot about that. 
So there we go. So just out of curiosity, let's see how much her offense goes up by. It's currently 45, which is just awful. But you equip the frying pan. And now her offense is 49? Was that wrong? Did it go up by four points? I'm so glad I went out of my way to get that frying pan. I, I really am. Oh. Okay. Well, anyway, now, now you head to the left. Okay, because you go, you go up first, then left. For the record, the, this had to be one of the earlier places I went because uh, basically what you do in the first screen, the, f the first thing you do, I don't know, whatever. You can just piece together. Just look up, like, if you're at this point in the game, just look up a map. It's not worth, it's not worth it to try and figure out where you're going by yourself. I don't like looking things up in games, but even, but like, I, I reach a point where it's, it's not worth it to figure it out yourself. And I just, it's, it's not. So, just do yourself a favor and don't bother. Okay, so, now, here's another crossroad that I may have been to. Oh, Jiminy Cricket. I think that this was the, the area where Anna died last time. Because, uh, there is a very interesting thing about this crossroad and that it's I really really wanted to get to this crossroad wow Nintendo one shot someone but Teddy didn't impressive of course it's because that guy was guarding so it doesn't even matter and then there you go all these freaking triple starman fights are the worst Well, Anna's, Anna's gonna catch up to Lloyd, and it's not Lloyd's fault, but whatever. Okay, so now you go straight, you go through here, and let's... Oh, another present! Who who knew that the Hank Spat was right here? Well, not me! I did, actually. I should have looked up what the Words of Love do. wonder if anybody else... Yes, okay, let's just give them to Teddy. And then we'll give the bat to Ninten. And now let's see how much his offense goes up by 114 to 130. See, he went up by 16. So, I... Just, it's stupid that Anna is supposed to be a terrible fighter. Un like, unless she uses magic. In which case, she's an amazing fighter, because magic is so useful. Her useful magic is so cheap. Of course, she does have less than 100 PP already, but whatever. Oh no, 97! Ah. Oh. You're both useless. Don't hit Teddy. I swear to God. So there you go. In a way, Anna actually killed two guys in one turn. Because it was her Franklin badge that bounced it back. Um, nah, whatever. We're almost out of the cave. Ah, <sighs> jeez, crackers. Okay. So, Teddy levels up. And... Ah, oh, we're almost there! Just let me leave! Sorry. <sighs> I'm calm.
Don't you even... You son of a bitch! You son of a bitch. I swear to God, if she dies, I'm gonna be so fucking pissed. And I'm going to strangle somebody. Anybody. I don't care who. I'm gonna strangle somebody, though. That's right. That's what I thought, Cerebrum. Now you're afraid of Dracula. Cut that. Don't don't put that in the episode. Nobody's gonna get the reference. I'm just dating myself. Okay. Oh, wait. There's one more screen. I forgot. I, for I thought that was the exit. There's one more screen. One more screen. This is a long path, but it leads to the, uh... It leads to the exit. Whew. Oh, oh, wait a second. I know how this works. No, UPSI Magnet, the one that ten hits, because Teddy's gonna one-shot him. <sighs> hey. PK Beam Beta. Ow. You jerk. That hurt. We're gonna, we're gonna give it one extra turn. Here. Ow. Stupid head. No effect. Lame. Well, how about that? That had an effect on you. Okay. Okay, we're almost out of there. We're almost out of here. We're, we're gonna make it, guys. We're gonna make it. Edit out all of the... all. Just edit out all of the remaining fights in this episode. Okay. So, uh... Here we go, the final present. And it's a PSI stone. There are a lot of PSI stones in this game. I haven't used any of them. I, I've been saving them because I thought they were really rare, but apparently they're not. Also, I think you can reuse them, but that might only be in Earthbound when they actually are rare. And here we are. Go, get out of there, go. Oh, we made it. We're outside. Okay. 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 Titanian? Is that different from what they were called earlier? Now, I don't think PK Freeze is going to have an effect on them. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Jerk. Oh, it does have an effect. Cool. The effect was death. Well, a delayed death, but death nonetheless. And that'll do it. Ah, ah, ah. Mwah, ah, 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 ah. Ah, 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 ah. So, let's, uh. Whoops. Let me just, uh. Heal. Her up. Now, I gotta find, like, a house or something. I see there's... Yep, okay. Am I, am I fighting a tree right now? Oh, Megaborg! Well, that's... unexpected. I, uh, I don't know why... whatever this, like, super samurai is doing here, but... whatever. But I think he used PSI on me, right? He used Beam, right? think. So next time I fight one, Anna can at least get some PSI back. Where's this house? I just want to get to the house so I can save and hopefully save. I'm not positive if I can save or not, but I hope I can. Um, I don't know... Oh my god. Well, okay then. Um <sighs> Did 
Teddy returns to the scene. Okay, so here's the thing. Okay, that uses a lot of PP, so... Um, I don't... I don't remember telling Nintendo to use it on himself. But it looks like he still has it, so... Seventeen. God, that's... And then you take one step and you're back in a fight. I just... I don't... I don't want to do this anymore. I'm leaving. I don't care. I go how big is this mountain like, I know the mountain is big but I just I just want to get to the building oh my god there's so much so much fighting why can't we just be friends why do we have to why does violence always have to be the answer why can't we be friends rock oils Rock oil, rock like gargoyle. Ah! Oh, that was PK Freeze Gamma. I get it. I didn't know they could do that, but okay. Let's uh, try stealing some PP. Ah ah! Your stupid PK Freeze Gamma doesn't do anything for you. You gotta be smart when you use it, like me. Okay, yes, let's, uh, I gotta keep him alive, though. Actually, you know what? Let's heal him. Oh, that, I guess beta was a bit more than I needed, but whatever. I have to be near the house, right? It's it's impossible for it to be much further. I know I know I said that about Duncan's factory. Yes, there it is. Ah. Oh, sweet telephone of of not being dead. Ah. Oh, I wanted to end this episode around now. Oh my god, this episode. So long. Uh, there was something specific that I wanted to end this episode on, but I don't know how long it's going to be until that happens. Okay, I'm going to do a quick test. Can the see me? Will you heal me? Yes. Thank you. Sweet, merciful... I'm sure you two would like to be alone. I'll make a few phone calls and wait out here. What? Oh, it's the dance. I forgot all about this part. Please stay with me, okay? Silence falls. Did she say that out loud? Intent, please stay with me. Silence falls. Would you like to dance? Dance in the silence? Do we at least keep music? This just, like, this just came right out of nowhere, didn't it? Is it just me? Do I have to move? Nope, I don't. Okay, well, I guess, uh... I guess we'll end it after this. Uh, what happens if you say no? My god, this episode was a... <sighs> this part of the game is a bit of a nightmare.
Uh, sure. Did you hear those loud noises? Uh, those noises came from outside. Not in here, silly. Oh, uh, apparently they did come from in here. Well, the, isn't this just a mood killer? Ha <laughs> ha! I, I mean, I guess. Um, I can't win this fight, I don't think. So, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna fight. I don't know if I have to do, if I have to survive for a certain number of turns or not. Ha, 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 yeah, yeah, I have to, I bet, I bet that's it, I have to survive for a certain number of turns. This guy's doing, this guy's doing, a uh, 500 damage per, he did 600 to Nintendo. Zap! And look who's the hero! Oh, okay, so... This is a bit of a mistranslation. The original version, he actually said, Oh shoot, I'm too late. But, uh, now it just... Now it just kind of seems like he hit us. But he didn't. He, he's, he destroyed the robot. Or at least he chased the robot away. And, uh, he saved us. And then, I guess he... Picked us up. I don't know, whatever. But this is actually what I wanted to end the episode on. Because Lloyd's back! Yeah! The gang's all here, sort of. Oh no. No. No! Why am I back here? No, this isn't the place I want to be! I want to be back on the mountain! Son. Of. A. Bitch. Okay, well. Brood strength is not enough to beat them. I know that now. I know now that peace can be brought back to us. I believe. Hey, Lloyd. Now is the time you must fight for yourself. Now it is the weakling's turn. You stay here and wait. Well, I guess... I guess I'm walking all the way back up the mountain! I can't wait to do that. But I'm not gonna subject you to that because I... Oof, this is a long episode. So... Thank you so much for watching. Tune in next time. I'll already be at the top of the mountain. In fact, I'm going to level grind for a while anyway, so it doesn't matter. But tune in next time. You can click the little bubbles to subscribe or watch other episodes if you want. Other than that, have a nice day, and goodbye.